वेलकम बैक गाइस सो आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू विल बी फाइन दिस इज क्वेश्चन 2.67 एंड द स्टेटमेंट हियर इज दैट कंसीडर द सिचुएशन ऑफ एग्जांपल 2.32 ओके सो द एग्जांपल हियर इज 2.32 ऑन पेज 58 सो व्हाट इज दैट एग्जांपल लेट मी हैव इट हियर सो दिस इज द एग्जांपल 2.32 द प्रोबेबिलिटी इज दैट एन ऑटोमोबाइल मैकेनिक विल सर्व 3 4 5 6 7 और 8 और मोर कार्स ऑन एनी गिवन वर्क डे आर रिस्पेक्टिवली 0.12, एंड 0.07 ओके सो लेट मी फर्स्ट राइट देम हेयर सो आई हैव द नंबर ऑफ कार्स हेयर एंड देयर रिस्पेक्टिव प्रोबेबिलिटीज हेयर व्हाट लेट मी राइट देम हेयर सो आई कैन हैव हेयर थ्री Four, five, six, seven, eight, or more. Okay, so I have different cars here. Uh, for the three, I have zero point one two. For four, I have zero point one nine. Okay, I have zero point two eight. For five, for six, I have zero point two four. Zero point two four. Okay, for seven, I have zero point one zero. 0.10 and uh, for eight or more, I have 0.07. 0.07. Okay, so by adding them all, you will see that all of them will be added to one. Okay, so the answer of it will be one, and that is the essence of the probability. Okay, so on the basis of it, what do I have to find out here? Uh, that is the question or example here so let me first find the solution of this example and let me tell you what is inherent in it so what is the probability that he will serve at least five cars on his next day at work okay so uh, in this example i have to find out the probability that he will service cars at least five cars on the next day okay so the cars should be greater or equal to five okay or it can be what it can also be one minus probability that he will service cars less than five okay? so how is it possible i have previously told you guys that always the probability of cars greater or equal to five plus the probability of cars less than five this ultimate sum of it will always be one because this is the overall scenario here because uh, here you can very easily see that the cars greater or equal to 5 are here while the cars less than 5 are here okay so this is the overall which is 1 okay so having it all the ranges uh, lies here what we have here we can see that here this is the same range we have here which has been graphically illustrated here in this cars okay uh, similarly from it i can also have a formula which is here now uh, putting all values here what we can see that probability of the cars greater or equal to 5 is 1 minus probability of cars less than 5 so these are what 1 minus probability of the cars less than 5 are which so these are the probability of the cars equal to what 4 plus the probability of the cars equal to 3 okay so these are the two scenarios which has been mentioned here and these are the probabilities which i already know putting them here i will get what this would be 0 0.19 okay and it would be 0. 1 to here we have here is okay so it would be 1 minus 0 0.19 0 0.12 is 0 0.31 which will ultimately give me 1 minus 0 0.31 is 0 0.69 okay. so that is what that is the solution of the example 2.32 okay so uh, as we have seen all the scenarios which has been going on here i will try to solve the question 2.67 in our upcoming video so you are expected 
to grasp all the concepts which are now illustrated in example 2.32 if you have any question you can ask me in the comment box see you soon welcome back guys so uh, in previous video we have seen the solution of example 2.32 okay and the answer of it we have got and on the basis of it we have also seen the limits which are mentioned here and uh, how can these limits are summed up to one okay so now on the basis of it let me solve different parts of question 2.67 and the first part of it is what is the probability that no more than four cars will be served by the mechanic okay so this is part a let me write it the solution okay this is the solution of part a and what do i have to find out i have to find out that uh, there are no more than four cars which are served by the mechanic so cars are less than or equal to four so we can also write it like probability of the cars equal to four plus the probability of the cars equal to three okay which are what which are basically mentioned here in these two scenario and this is what these are the number of cars uh, less than four equal or equal to four okay so this is three four now putting their values here what i will get uh, the probability of cars equal to four is 0 0.19 and the probability of cars equal to three that is uh, how much that is 0 0.12 adding them all together i will get 0 0.31 okay so that is the solution of part a of this question okay similarly for part b let me write here for part b what is the probability that he will service fewer than eight cars okay so what do i have to do i have to find the probability that he will service the number of cars which are fewer than eight okay so eight are basically all of them so i have to add the probability of three four five six seven um, all of them all together so it will be difficult for me so i can see here that if this is less than eight i can also have the other part of it and that is what that is the probability of cars greater than or equal to eight okay i know that i have already uh, the probability of the events where the cars are greater or equal to 8 so let me put it here and i will see that this is 0 0.07 so it will be 0 0.07 so by adding the probability of only one event i can have the final results and it would be 0 point what 93 and that is the probability of the event that the serviced cars will be less than eight number of cars okay so that is the solution of part b similarly in part c what is the probability that he will service either three or four cars so what is this he will have to service the number of cars equal to three or four cars so or is usually represented by this union or the number of cars is equal to four so there i have so now here i have to do what i have to add them together because now the probability that cars are equal to three plus the probability of cars equal to four okay so these are the two events which are here in this union okay so these are basically the two events let me underline them here as well this is the first one this is the second one while this one is now put it here and this one here now putting their probabilities which i already know this one is here this one is here so now let me put them here and i will get one the probability of it is 0 0.12 and the probability of force is 0 0.19 which will ultimately give me 0 0.31 and that is the probability of the event that he will service either three or four cars okay so that is the solution of part c which we have seen here so we have solved part a part b part c on the basis of the conditions given here so this is the first condition this is the second 
and this is the last one so uh, if you guys have any question you can ask me in the comment box so that's it for today and i will see you soon